Hey everyone, up for auction we have a 1995 Chevy Beretta and uh, this is the coupe and it's a very nice car. I'm going to show you the ins and outs of this but uh, a, lot of, a lot of people have nostalgia around these vehicles. Um, very nice for the era. They were a lot of fun to drive around in. This one uh, has no known mechanical issues. It runs and drives well. It only has 127,000 miles on it. So this is going to be a, a great car for someone uh, that really likes these Berettas. And so we're going to jump right in, show you everything we know about the vehicle. So looking at the uh, the top, you can see the paint is good on the roof. I don't see any uh, any kind of sun fade of any kind uh, coming down the, the hood of the car. Um, you got something here. This, this looks like it'll come right off. I think it's just some kind of like gum or something, but that looks like it's on top of the paint. Um, looking down the whole hood itself, uh, everything looks pretty good. In general, it looks slightly dull, but it's not, but barely noticeable. So you look back and uh, you can see, you know, it's still got some sheen to it. Uh, just just has a little bit of, of age to the paint. Uh, but looking down below here, uh, looking at the bumper going across, the front bumper I would say is in excellent shape. Doesn't look like it ever got uh, hit or anything like that. Um, going down the side, you can see the fender is great. I, this is a really nice car. I mean, I, I don't even see any uh, real dings or anything to speak of. There's a little, little teeny scratch right there. Uh, but it's very, very shallow, that scratch. Um, looks great here. And the tires, tires look terrific. Uh, you know, this was donated to the Paralyzed Veterans of America. So something tells me this was a well-kept uh, vehicle. Probably it looks, looks to be maintained with a car this age to have tires like this and look the way it does with the mileage. You know, I think somebody just drove this <coughs> sparingly over the years and uh, ended up donating it in the end. But uh, looking at the, the back here, you can see the trunk uh, is in really great shape. The paint is terrific. Uh, all the lights and everything seem to work well. You see the Beretta decal there. And uh, we're going to go ahead and look at the back bumper, which also looks really great. I don't see... Uh, this person must have been a good driver. It doesn't look like they really bumped into anything. Uh, overall, it's just a really good condition on the exterior. So we're gonna go down the, the passenger side. Now here is, this is, looks to be maybe even on the clear coat surface. I don't know if you can even see that. There's a little uh, scratch going down the side there, but it uh, looks very, very shallow. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty certain you might be able to even get that out. It looks like it's just the clear coat to me. But uh, looking at the bottom here, you can see everything looks good. The tire, front tire is in really great shape so you're not going to need uh, tires for this thing there is a little scratch it almost feels like I think that's actually coming up off the paint that might be something just on the paint Look down you got a little, little scratch right there back tire excellent shape uh, very very good shape it's cl pretty close to new that looks good there. So coming down the, you know, the columns of this thing, you know, there's really no, no sun fade at all. Uh, the windows, everything are great. Uh, the windshield doesn't have any cracks or anything in it. Let me see. Actually, I'm sorry. There is a tiny little, little ping right there, uh, but it, it's small. See, so back up, you can see. So you could probably do a quick fix on that. Just wanted to note that as well. And uh, looking at the, the car, uh, if you're unfamiliar with these, it's got this really cool handle that comes down. Kind of a futuristic thing that they did back then. And uh, <clears throat> as you can see, it has a fresh smog certificate. So this one's ready to be picked up and driven away. There's no check engine lights or anything. And uh, the interior is in really great shape. Could use a good cleaning. There is, uh, you know, obviously some dirt and things here and there. But uh, in general, it's pretty good. The driver's seat is you know, clearly the most worn of, of anything in here, uh, just from sliding in and out. Could have been, a, you know, maybe a bigger bigger person driver. And the middle console, uh, you know, is still there and intact, but it's just kind of smashed in a little bit. But the passenger seat looks great. I don't see any, any issues with that. Look at the passenger side and the door and everything is in really great, great condition as well. 
the uh, up top here, you can see there's no cracking in the dash of any kind. And uh, looking down here, you can see it's all that original, original equipment. And uh, it's got 127,806 miles on it. And if you look in the back seat, the back seat just clearly looks almost new. I mean, it's it's very, very nice. I don't see any any kind of uh, you know rips or tears or anything in the back seat there. Just a really really nice car in general. So, if you like these Berettas or if you just need something that is good to get around town, runs and drives, has a fresh smog certificate, this could be yours. You can bid on motobucks.com or download the app for Android or iTunes. Good luck, everyone.